the most predictable ALCS ever. It's the Cleveland Guardians. It's Cleveland. Cleveland loses against the Yankees. The grandfather of Aaron Boone, Ray Boone, won the World Series with the Indians in 1948. So Aaron Boone is going to win the AL pennant against the team that last won the World Series when his grandfather was on the roster. He enters the pennant series with 17 wins in the playoffs as Yankees manager. It is Ray that's Camacho 17. It's this tribute to Ray Boone, his grandfather, that is going to result in the Yankees appearing in the World Series for the 41st time after 40 prior appearances in the World Series. So this is what we see right here with the Guardians. Guardians is Camacho 40. The Yankees won 94 games during the regular season. They have 40 prior appearances in the World Series. Cleveland Guardians is 73. The, uh, it equals 107, the 28th prime number. The Yankees 28th championship. Cleveland Guardians is 73. Then on to the World Series to face off against the Dodgers. Aaron Boone is 51 years of age. He's born in the year in the year 73. It's also at Ohio where Aaron Boone made his major league debut with the Cincinnati Reds. And as you know, the death of Pete Rose. Pete Rose passed away, but the Yankees manager Aaron Boone made his debut with the Cincinnati Reds in 1997. Cleveland did win the World Series in 1948. Cleveland's Camacho 48, so, th so they've used the reverse method going back for decades. Cleveland's Camacho 78. If the Yankees win the pennant against Cleveland, I think the last two times the Yankees defeated the Dodgers in back-to-back -back years in the World Series was 1977 and um, 1978. So that may be the meaning of the Gamatria of Cleveland having Gamatria 78. So when we go to 1977 and 1978, the Yankees beat the Dodgers back-to-back -back years. Cleveland's Gamatria 78. The Yankees' 42nd appearance is going to be a repeat because Aaron Judge is Gamatria 42. Aaron Judge and World Series go like clockwork. Aaron Judge is 57. World Series is 57. So it is going to be a scripted playoff win over the Cleveland Guardians. It has everything to do with the grandfather of Aaron Boone. Grandfather's Gamachi World Series. So let's go to the list of Guardian seasons. Terry Francona is no longer there. Yankees beat the former Red Sox manager in 2022. This would be a rematch. And a loss is on the way. They have 60 losses. They'll get the 64 against the New York Yankees. New York Yankees is going to 64. So that's a pretty easy call. Because it does include their, their series record against the Tigers. So the Guardians go fall to a 2-2 two two playoff series wild card round ever since changing to the name the Guardians with a loss against Aaron Boone and Aaron Judge. Looks like a Yankees beat the Rays again. Tampa Bay Rays. Yankees be a California native before they head to California. So that's what Stephen Vogt is about. It's probably not a great playoff record against the Yankees. They are a 15th playoff loss 
against a 15-6 light path. Great judge, you know, before the Yankees deal with the Dodgers, their 15th World Series loss in their history. The Yankees own the Guardians. One, two, three. Uh, they beat the Yankees in 2007. Uh, they beat them in 1997. So this is a pretty good rivalry, I mean. They'll fall to 2-5 and five against the Yankees in the playoffs. Juan is Gamatri of uh, Juan Soto's Gamatri 25. Soto's Gamatri of the 15th playoff series loss overall in Guardian history. But yeah, the Guardian season is going to end pretty soon. If not today, they're definitely going to happen sometime in the next week.